What's up guys, Justin here with the SketchUpEssentials.com back with another SketchUp extension overview for you. So in today's video, we're going to check out another extension from Valley Architects that allows us to quickly add cladding materials to faces in our models. Before we get started, I want to thank my newest supporter on Patreon. So big thank you to Molham Nabil Alasai. Patreon, as most of you know, is the website where you can support creators that you like on YouTube. One of the perks of supporting the show is you get to vote on the extension that I cover every week. So if that's something that you're interested in, you want to support the show, maybe vote on the extension I'm covering, make sure you check out that link in the notes down below. Now let's go ahead and just jump into it. Plugin name, Instant Cladding. Plugin developer, Valley Architects. Plugin cost, it's $19 a year. Where can you get it? You can download it from the Valley Architects website at the link in the notes down below. Tool functions. Instant cladding is an extension from Valley Architects that helps you quickly create real 3D cladding in your SketchUp models. It's great for creating wood or metal siding, stone walls, log walls, and much more. In addition, you can also use it to create things like wood molding on the interior of your models. As with the rest of the extensions from Valley Architects, this one is really easy to use. Simply select the wall you'd like to add cladding to, select a material, and click Run. This will add the cladding material of your choice to your geometry. Note that some of the wall types, like the stone, take a long time to run, so make sure you save your model before doing this. One thing that's worth doing is going up and adding the Valley Architects material library to your model using the extension menu. This means that materials like stone, wood, and more will show up in your material list for selection, allowing you to quickly apply materials in your models. There's a complete material library in here with lots of different cladding materials that you can add to your models. Another cool function is on, a on materials like the logs, you can actually add ends to your logs, creating a true log cabin look within your models. You can also set wainscoats on your wall materials, allowing for short stone cladding on top of logs, as well as other siding and cladding combinations as well. You can set these based on a custom height above ground. You can go back and edit materials for objects within your model after they've been created, allowing for true customization of your models. You can also set corner conditions of your materials for true customization of the effect that can be created. Since cladding materials are added based on the shape of the face within your model, this allows for really interesting cladding options. Once you get this all set up properly, adding cladding materials to your models is super easy and your models look much more realistic than they did before. I'm really liking the possibilities contained in this extension. That's where I'm going to end this video. Leave a comment below and let me know what you thought. Do you like this extension? Would you like for me to talk about it more? I just love having that SketchUp conversation with you guys. If you like this video, please remember to click that like button down below. If you're new around here, remember to click that subscribe button for new SketchUp content every week. If you like what I'm doing on this channel, please consider supporting me on Patreon. Every little bit helps, even if it's only a dollar a month. So make sure you check out that link in the notes down below. But in any case, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. I really appreciate it, and I will catch you in the next video. Thanks, guys.